In this Illustrator tutorial, I'm going to talk about how to save default settings in Illustrator. To save default settings and preferences, you need to not have an Illustrator document open. If you have a document open, it will save the settings for that document, but when you open a new document or open a different document, it will not have those same settings. So right here, we're on the document open window, the new document uh, window, I guess. And what we need to do now is change any settings we want to be saved as default. Some of those settings can be found in the various drop down menus. So as you go through here, you might find some different settings or effects or windows. Like for instance, if you want specific windows open, you might be able to highlight them here uh, or in the view drop down. Like if you always want smart guides turned on or turned off or corner widget, etc., this is where you can change those settings before you create a document. Also, any Illustrator preferences. So as we go down to Illustrator settings and then even starting with general here, we can actually open up the preferences. All of these are your default preferences. You can reset the preferences down here, but then you can also change anything in here. So if we never want to show rich tool tips, which are those little video pop-ups when you're hovering over tools, we can turn those off before we have a document open and this will save across the board. Now you can go down through all of these preferences, check them out, find what you want and what you don't want. Like if you want to change the color of your guides for every document you can. Same thing with smart guides, how they pop up. So as you go down through here, make some adjustments, press OK, and that saves them as your default settings in Illustrator. Now any new file or new document you open will include whatever your preferences are. And if you ever need to adjust them, I think one of the biggest ones to adjust actually that I forgot about is the units. So depending on what units you like to work in, this before you have a document open is where you can change the default units of any new document. So if you work in inches a lot or in centimeters a lot, you can change to those before you ever open a document so that you can actually have that as your default for any document. I tend to work in pixels a lot, so I like to keep it as pixels and hit OK. So now any new file I open is going to start out by saying pixels as the unit and I don't have to change this unless I specifically need a different unit for this document. So that's how you can change preferences or default preferences and set them here in Illustrator.